This is for the girlies who really love floral type of scents. Stop playing with them, Ryan. Your fear of looking stupid is holding you back. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Katie Lux. I'm back with another week's video. Thank you for tuning in for my return and subscribers. You guys know how much I love you guys from the moon and back. And if you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. My name is Katie Lux. This channel is a lot to do with fashion, lifestyle, travel, vlogs, um, em woman empowerment, everything under the sun <laughs> that I love, that represent me and my personality, I will be sharing with you guys. So go ahead now and hit the subscribe button, thumbs up this video. But before you even thumbs up this video, ensure that you'll be watching this video all the way through leave a comment in the comment section let me know how was your day did you have a great day did you have a, a bad day what was up with your week i really love to hear you guys and you guys thoughts and remember you guys are my com my community my family my friend my best friend my you know my everything and i really love and appreciate you guys share hit that share button and let's get into this video so i went to see my one of my girlfriends today and she was like oh my god you always smell so freaking good spill the tea like what are you wearing babe and i'm like spill the tea what tea what tea is that a spill and she's like babe put me on what perfume are you wearing and i'm like girl I don't just wear one perfume, I wear a collection, a collective heart. And she was like, please just tell me what you're wearing because you always smell so freaking good. And I'm like, damn girl, thanks. Like, thank you. You know, I'm all blushing and that. And she was like, you know what? Why don't you even share it with your subscribers? I'm sure they will love love to know your favorite summer perfume, you know? So today's video will be a, a perfume haul, perfume collection, my favorite, favorite summer perfumes and a favorite summer perfumes that I think that you will love. So if you're a floral girly, you love flowers like me, you love being in your feminine aura, in your end feminine energy, and you just love smelling sweet all day long now you want to keep on watching because i'm about to put you on don 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 so some of these perfumes i have been gifted a few and the rest i've literally purchased with my own money and i was so excited about the whole purchase and stuff because i really wanted to get my hands on these for a long time and i ended up just dashing away the box and i'm like my friend's right, I should really put you guys on because as she said, I always smell good. I literally always get compliments when I wear these colognes. Like always, 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 always get compliments. So literally, I'm just gonna like start with whatever I grab. But these are a lot with floral scents. Um, so if you like this light, um, not very like too strong, this is for you. I have one that is very musky and woody type of scent. So I always mix it with a floral scent to kind of balance it off to, to suit me, my personality and my style. And they always say whenever you spray perfume and you don't smell it yourself, it means that it suits you. But if you spray perfume and you actually always smell it, it means the end for you. I don't know how true it is. I don't know. I don't know but whenever i spray my perfume i usually literally don't smell it sometimes i have to ask but the compliments i always get when i use this perfume i know damn well that these perfume are popping and it's for me so let me stop rambling and let me put you guys on 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 <laughs> as always everything will be linked in the description box so be sure to check them out i don't have a, like a discount code or whatever to give you guys but I promise you, and if you buy these, you will not regret it, baby. You will not, you will not regret it. I promise you, will not regret it. So let's start with Mrs. Jo Malone. 
literally literally one of my all-time favorite 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 perfume from Jo Malone is literally my second bottle I literally afraid to use her because when I start using her like like I, I don't stop like I go I go all over like all over my body and when I tell you how much I add door Jo Malone and I adore this perfume no not all scents I love from Jo Malone so this one is like a poppy and barley cologne so this one is like a mixture of like floral fruity um I think there is a bit of um vanilla scent with it I'm not too sure I'm just gonna double check with you guys on that so just give me a hot minute because I really want to make sure I'm providing the correct information when it comes to this perfume but this perfume i love oh my gosh i love this one so 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 much but uh, give me a minute guys let me check for you guys so yes guys so the poppy and barlet barley oh my god i got i said barlet oh my god it's poppy and barley so this one is like a conic um as i said it's a floral scent and it topped with juicy black currant and cooled by cotton soft barley. So this one is like the hundred milliliter size. Literally love her, guys. Oh my god! When I tell you, I use this perfume so crazy because it have like a nice soft, subtle, like really clean, light type of scent. It's not vanilla. It's really, really fruity and floral, as I said. So if you're that type of girl that, you know, that loves, you know, fruity, floral type of scent, I promise you, you will love this perfume. You will love Poppy and Barley. And it's super perfect for the summer. The scent is like, it's, it's not strong, but it's really light and airy and it will last all day. You will not regret wearing this. This is like my go-to perfect, perfect, perfect summer cologne. They do come in like different size, but I really prefer the 100 um, uh, um, milliliter. So guys, this perfume literally won an award, I think, in 2020. 20, 18 19 20 2020 something around there i will double check for you guys but this perfume literally won like a award for the best scent at that period of time it was like spring summer so the best spring summer scent this definitely won an award and i'm telling you it literally worth it it is it worth it worth worth that award because tell me why oh my god oh my gosh guys tell me why like why that that this cologne shouldn't win an award it's one of my all-time fave like when i spray it on you it literally lasts all day even after i shower i literally smell this on my body it's like such such a perfect perfect summer cologne perfect 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 i literally i i i lay my life down on this like i'm not bullshitting you i literally live, lay my life down on this perfect scent oh my god next we're gonna go for i'm i'm gonna go random now now this one okay so it's gonna be like a mixture of high end to low end like high end to high street or low end if you want to say now when you know the whole baccarat rouge perfume was going viral and everybody was getting it and it was completely sold out every every living single time and i was like oh what's a hype about and then they say oh zara created um the dupe of that which is red temptation so i decided to get that my fast self yes get this the red temptation from zara in the travel size bottle so this one is i think how much how much ml it's actually not saying here actually yeah, it's a 10 ml so i got this in the actual travel size and all of my colognes are actual perfumes they are not eau de toilette they're actually perfumes and oils so 
decided to get the whole Zara Temptation. Now, use this, and the minute the first time I used this, I kid you not, I didn't like it. So I was like, maybe it's new. I needed to like to grow on me because some perfumes when I just use it, I fall in love, and some perfumes when I just use it, I was like, mm, okay, I don't understand what's a hype. So I was like, okay, let me just let me continue to use it to give it a go. So I initially smelled the baccarat rouge oh my gosh i didn't like about last last weekend and i i decided i want to smell it let me see actually if the red temptation is actually the dupe of the the baccarat rouge i want to tell you that it is um it literally it smells exactly like the baccarat rouge so if you can't afford the baccarat rouge I'm telling you the red temptation from Zara mm, Zara is literally not sleeping on their perfume they Zara really have some pretty really nice dupe perfume so if you can't afford the high-end one I'm telling you head over to Zara because they literally all sold out and now I'm wishing I should have gotten the big bottle rather than the travel size because when I tell you how this stays the scent stays it is so strong i'm telling you when it's not strong in the sense of like burning your nose overpowering your nose strong in the sense that it lasts it lasts the day throughout the day and the day after it lasts this oh my god i guys i love it it's like it have like a, a sweet i don't know like to me to have like a, a light floral scent to it there is some a light floral scent like a, a, a mix of like vanilla in it it's really light it's really light it smells really it smells gorgeous it, it's not smells like woody or musky or, or oaky type of, of type of perfume this smells really light really really feminine and floral it really do smells like floral fruity as well i'm kind of getting like a really nice sweet strawberry type of scent but subtle because it's like a really nice gorgeous mixture i'm telling you when you use this or wear this you won't regret it and i usually love to use the the red temptation and this together literally when i pair this two together is like a bomb in itself like the perfect combination the perfect perfect combo in itself so i'm telling you the red temptation perfect scent perfect perfume scent for the summer i kid you not you will not regret your purchase you will not regret wearing this you'll be reaching for this every time you go out and by the two tools you know you know you need another bottle because this I don't rub it on my skin like this. I like do this. <laughs> I literally like, like, look, if you can see, I, I splash the perfume like that. And I use this like three times and look how much I use in a bottle. Now the ball part is not that, it's not quite like secure. So that's why when I splash it like that, a lot tends to come out. So if you're using this or you tend to get this, I will tell you to be careful with how you use it because, and try not to use a lid because it can leak there is leakage because of the ball is not the right ball for the actual perfume but the perfume itself is a perfect perfect summer cologne perfume you will not regret this super floral super fruity last all day all day even if you shower baby you'll be smelling that next day i even use it as a form of deodorant because and it does keep it keeps it keeps on the there smelling really really nice and when i use it i use it for there and no kidding no kidding when i do use it i i tend to perspire less and every time i raise up my arm i get the scent of a red temptation <laughs> a good temptation a good listen a good temptation not a bad temptation so like this is like you know like the devil wears prada it's like that baby <laughs> okay moving on moving on 
now i got this as a gift this is like the christina algalera and this one is in 30 ml now i literally recently started using this it is a perfect perfect summer perfume um yes yeah, perfect summer perfume that um is not something that i tend to always reach for um on the go if i'm using this i literally mix it so i will mix it like with the red temptation or i'll mix it with of course the drum alone because to me i find it goes better to with um a different cologne rather than on its own um it's it is nice to be honest but it's not one of my all-time fave favorite 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 but it's a nice type of perfume to go if i have to go and run errands or if i have to go to grocery shopping of course like errand day i would tend to like go for this because this is like the perfect subtle type of summer perfume to go for if i'm going on errands now mind you if i'm going on a night out oh, if i'm going on a dinner date yeah i'll be wearing these two together because these two i'll be i will hold up the room from the time i enter the room everybody will be like who just enter I, i'll be like the spotlight of that restaurant i will be getting everyone attention because my scent this two perfect perfect summer perfume and date night so if you can have a date baby i'm telling you wear these two together You'll be a showstopper. I'm telling you, I promise you, you will be a showstopper. Get it and wear it together and let me know in the comment section. I will, I'm not bullshitting you. If I'm bullshitting you, call me out. Let me know. Call me, call me out. Call, check me. Check me. I give you the right to check me. If you think I'm, I'm, I'm chatting shit, check me. <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> let's get back to us. So, <laughs> let's get back to Mrs. Christina Angelera. Okay. <laughs> so this perfume now is like literally the perfect perfume for like errand runs. So this one is it's very strong. It's not it's not it's have like a light type of fruit fruity scent to it, like light light very light very light and very um like fruity and very light floral but it's more i'm getting more of like a woody type of musky scent so you have like a bit of it's it's not in the middle it's not a balance it's more it's very like strong the scent is very opaque and strong and you get more of like a a hard type of woody oak yeah, I'm getting that kind of oak type of scent and then just like a hint of floral and fruit type of scent. So the floral and fruit type of scent is very, it's very light. It's very, very subtle, like really subtle. So when I just spray it, I get like the floral fruit scent. And then after I'm getting that type of like hard, strong, musky, woody type of scent. So if that, if this if this is like your cup of tea you would definitely like this yeah you would definitely like this if like woody musky with a hint of floral and, and fruity scents you would definitely like this so i definitely i tend to more grab this if i'm going to run errands like you know to grocery shopping or if i have like bits and bobs um to use i think this is like perfect for errands day and it is long lasting i i have used it as you can see i don't tend to grab it all the time as you can see it's not one of my all-time favorite but is it is one that i tend to use only when i'm going for errands when i'm doing errand runs so yeah it's 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 on that type of side so if that is your cup of tea i'm you're gonna like you're gonna like this but for me it's oh, it's it's not my favorite favorite, but it will work. It will do. I I I tend to more like to like mix this with the um as I said earlier the Jo Malone the Poppy and Barley because it's much more of like a fruity 
um, floral types of scent so it tend to tone down the, the woody musky oak scent in this to make it to me in my opinion make me feel a bit more feminine and make me smell a bit more soft and feminine but if you like that strong type of manly type of scent because i know some women really love that this year i would definitely recommend like you get this so next here we go so we just do like oak woody we're gonna do another oak woody type so everybody know sauvage deal everybody know that this perfume is a showstopper why did i get this perfume this is literally a man's perfume why did i get it i really like it and you'll be surprised like you love floral and fruity perfume what make you go for this strong woody musky oak scent i'm telling you why because it goes really well with the other perfume that i'm gonna show you but everybody knows how dior did it like how dior really really did it like this is a showstopper you guys know i'm not chatting shit to this i'm not lying this is like an all-time most like adorable scent like to be honest i wouldn't recommend you use this in the summer because the heat of the heat literally is gonna kill you because to me this is much more of like a perfect like autumn um spring type of scent so i don't even know why i'm telling you to use it but if you want to kill someone on the bus <laughs> or you, you want to enter everybody want to knock someone out <laughs> or you want to make someone sign us raids use this because of how strong it is it is so strong the scent it is super 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 opaque i know i'm not even supposed to use the word opaque when it comes to scent but i'm telling you it is it's so strong it's 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 so loud it the loudness is deafening and when i'm telling you this stays on all day if you have this perfume you would know if you got this perfume for your boo your babe you will know that this is so loud and it stays for the entire day even if after you shower it is so strong that it, you still smell it on your body but i love it i look i don't know you only could see it in the light as to how far it reached i use this perfume i don't use it a lot because of how strong it is one spray is enough two you're going overboard three now you're taking a piss four now you really want to kill somebody and five who is going who is paying for your coffin <laughs> okay who is paying for it and no, not me not me <laughs> so please if you do decide to get this use this with discretion because one spray is enough Oof, it's so strong but it's so it smells so nice i really love to smell this on men but i actually like using it as well and i tend to go on this on days when i'm moody when i'm in like the how do you say the dark femininity like when that you know that dark feminine love that love that that type of Mm, i tend to use that on those days and it's really very rare that i'm in those moments but this is actually more perfect for like awesome scent than a summer scent because you will kill somebody with this in the summer even yourself even yourself okay <laughs> next then we have mrs dior lady dior now when i first buy this perfume i tell you i didn't love it i didn't like it i didn't love it i was like when i just i it, they did spread it for me for me to smell when i smelled it, i was like mm, this is so nice but i'm thinking that i chose the wrong one because the first one they, they spread two for me and i think there was one more floral or more fruity than this mind you this is floral and fruity but this floral and fruity comes over on like the strong side for me uh, yeah and this is like um in a 100 ml bottle i think the sauvage is also oh it's in 60 ml so i decided to get a smaller version of this one so this one is in 60 ml so for the mist here i got her in 100 ml um as you can see i tend to use her 
I tend to use her, but I don't use her a lot. I will grab her, I will use her, but I don't tend to use her too much. Um, one spray in this to me is enough because it is so strong. I love the head of the of the um uh of the perfume bottle because when you spray it, it's so powerful. You actually get the cologne on your body. It literally sprays and it stains the room. You literally really will will smell it. It's like the fruit is much more like of a heavy type of fruity scent guys let me just double check i i want to give you guys the correct information the accurate information so let's let us check like miss dior oh so would you believe that this perfume was awarded it won an award. Can you believe this? I always tend to I have that's that's to show you I have really good taste when it comes to perfume. And I didn't even I had no clue that this has won an award. So yeah, oh my gosh. So it's saying it's like um, love at first sight, um, wild in Peter's um, pressing desire to re-enchant the life of women. So it kind of telling you is they highlighting femininity here. So this was definitely highlighting femininity, um, bring harmony to and happiness and also poetry to women. So it's excites your beauty. I'm just like I'm paraphrasing here. Intrigues, insights. Um, it invites bring love and beauty to the world so so it's the floral scent as i tell you definitely you can you definitely know the type of girl i am so feminine super girly super feminine as you can see i love flowers <laughs> super feminine so girl girly so anything that is floral fruity i love even for drinks i tend to go out for more floral or fruity type of drinks so definitely as i said it's a floral um, type of perfume um, but it's not saying that the yeah so it's not actually saying it's not it's not telling me here the type of floor they use right it has amazing reviews so if you haven't had this perfume and you're iffy about it they really have amazing reviews on myself I do like it to be honest I really do like it but I don't always tend to go to grab it the very first thing to grab for me the very first thing to grab is always Jo Malone Jo Malone really has my heart and then I would tend to go and miss Dior so I tend to like to pair these two together because whenever I'm wearing Jo Malone I literally always pair like another perfume together to go with it so it give like a really nice to me it balance off the scent it really brings out my personality it brings out the more floral type of fruity scent in each other it's like to me it it complements and it coordinates with other so beautifully and so nicely so this for me is 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 like love at first sight really really love this our daughters to the moon and back super fruity super super fruity love me a fruity scent love and so strong it lasts all day i kind of get like a kind of like an orange peel time scent with it but i'm getting floral as well like really peachy type floral scent so it's super super duper nice super duper nice so yes guys so let me know your thoughts let me know what you think these are my personal opinion and experience for the perfect summer scents like literally the perfect perfect summer scents besides the savage i would recommend that you use this in the winter time autumn time and spring because of the coldness if you want like you you want your scent to stay to smell um that's when it's very cold um it's usually the coldest it makes um dull the scent of your perfume sauvage is perfect for that for this in the summer because it's so hot the heat it radiates the scent even more so these are the perfume you would not go wrong you would not regret if you get these 
I promise you, these are my 100% favorite summer colognes. And based on experience, as you can see, I have been using the perfume. So, and I've been using it for quite a while. I didn't just buy them yesterday and start using it and giving a review. I have been using this bad boy for a very long, long time. And if you've following me on my Instagram, you will know how long I had these bad boys since last year, baby. <laughs> Not even last year. Yeah, last year. Oh, yeah, before last year. <laughs> last year. Yeah, before even year before last year. My first bottle in this has run out and I got a second um, perfume because that's to tell you how hammer and crazy I go in with the drum alone. So yes guys, if you like this video and you enjoy me as usual, <laughs> don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Let me know your thoughts. Have you purchased them? Have you used them? Do you like them? What do you think about them? is it your kind of cup of tea is it perfect for you in the summer do you match well better in the summer for you or better in the autumn do you get any compliments on it let me know baby let me know let me know no no and also share this video with your friends and loved ones of course and i will see you guys on next week's video so thanks so much for watching it's your girl katie last bye